Okay, what I'm going to do right now is uh, jazz up this picture of the Sydney Opera House a little bit. And the first thing I need to do is go get my new cloud, so off the cloud CD. So I'm going to open up the cloud CD. You may have to explore to go find it. I'm going to look for an interesting cloud that has something cool going on around the top of it. How about that one right there? Now, to use this cloud, all I have to do is go to the word Edit and choose Define Pattern. By doing, clicking that button, Edit, Define Pattern, it's going to add it to the patterns that you already have loaded on your computer. You can give it a name if you want. I'm just going to use it the same name. And now I can close the uh, cloud. I don't need that anymore. So to use it, what I'm going to do is use the magic wand to select the background. Now one thing you got to be, be sure you know about, up here in the options bar for the magic wand, there's four selection, four different choices here. The first one is one selection, and it's only going to give you one selection, one selection only. You, what you need is the more useful one here, which says add to selection. So you can start a selection, and you can add a little more, add a little more. Keep clicking on the parts that haven't been selected in the sky. And even in between the building there. Uh, there it is. I've got the entire sky selected. Now to use the, uh, the pattern that I just made of the sky, I'm going to go to the uh, half black, half white uh, icon on the layers palette and says create new fill or adjustment layer and I use the pattern and the pattern that I just made will be the default to s to scale it to make it to size all you have to the easiest way to do it is click on the number and the, on the scale box and then if you hold down the the down arrow the numbers go down and of course the picture gets smaller I'm going to be looking for the edge of this pattern here Okay, I've come to the edge of the pattern, so I'm going to use the up arrow to resize it. And uh, and that's it. If once you get done, if you're uh, if you're not happy with that pattern, you can always go back and pick uh, any other pattern you want. And here I'll pick. There's a nice wispy cloud. Maybe I'll use that one instead. That's the one I picked. Maybe I'll use that one. Or use that one. And there you have it. I'm going to turn off the cloud. There's before and after. Before, boring. After, award-winning, exciting.